Hi guys, welcome back and today I'm super excited because I'm gonna be making some watermelon popsicles and let's just get on okay, with Okay, so I'm just gonna start by adding my watermelon into my blender and you could just add how much you want. Okay. So something like that. And I'm gonna add some water and I'll be back. Okay, so here is my watermelon, and if you are wondering how much water I added, I only added very little bit because watermelon already has a lot of water. So anyway, now I'm just gonna add some mint to it. If you don't have any mint leaves, that's okay, you could skip this step. But since I do have a mint plant growing, I am gonna take advantage of that and I'm gonna get some mint leaves and put it into my watermelon. Okay, so I'm gonna add the mint leaves that I just got and I washed them really good and they smell super good. So I'm gonna just add them in. If I could get them out. And now I'm gonna get some sugar. Okay, so now I'm just adding half a tablespoon of sugar. Now we try to keep it nice and healthy. And here's how it looks so okay, far. a tablespoon of lemon juice. Okay, that is it. Now I'm gonna go ahead and blend it and we'll see how it turns out. Okay guys, so now it's all nice and blended and it smells so good. So now I'm just gonna look for some popsicle molds. I'm gonna put it in there and um, we'll freeze them and I'll give them a try. Um, okay guys, I just noticed I do not have any cups or well, plastic cups or molds whatsoever. So I'm gonna be using these random graduation cups, things that I just found. And we're gonna, well, I'm gonna be using these as the molds and I'm gonna freeze them in here. So I'm gonna go ahead and just take this and I'm gonna pour it inside. And then I have some popsicle sticks I'll put in the middle and then I'll go ahead and freeze them. Okay guys, my mistake, um, I added too much water and now it's really liquidy. So the popsicles don't, the popsicles, the popsicle sticks do not stay in place, they just fall. Um, so for that reason, I'm gonna take them out and I'm just going to freeze them like this without them. And then somehow I'll just manage to put the popsicle sticks inside them once they're kind of frozen. And so now I'm just going to put them in the freezer. And I'll be back in like 15 minutes to oh check Guys, them. guess what I found? Yes, smaller cups. While I was cleaning up and putting my stuff away, I found these. And um, they're not graduation cups. So I'm so excited to give this a try and definitely was not 15 minutes for it to completely freeze. Maybe it's because of the container, but um, yeah, and there's no popsicle and stick here because it kept falling out and um, I just decided to leave it like this and I have this little spoon right here and I'm going to go ahead and try it just like that. Like if it's ice cream or something like that. and. Um, you guys could obviously like lick it like a popsicle, but I'm just gonna go ahead and give it this a try. Um, okay. If I could take a piece. And it smells really good. Okay, so I got a piece here, and I'm gonna go ahead and try it. It's so good and so refreshing. You guys will love it. And the little green stuff here are the pieces of mint that I put on it. So yeah. Um, so mine just started to melt and I'm just drinking it kind of like a juice or something. And it tastes really good just like that. And actually it kind of looks like someone throwing up. Um, yeah. Let me add a nose. Never mind. So anyway, hope you guys try it and I really recommend it, although it does melt pretty quickly. So um, just a little warning there. And maybe you should just leave it like this instead of a popsicle, but it works fine either way. And it's so good and hope you guys try it. Bye. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if you haven't already.